there's an unmarked door and then all of a sudden you walk into this other realm and it's a place where you wouldn't expect to see something like that. So we, we really enjoy that, that element of surprise. And then there's another room in the back where it's, you know, this very large figure is confronting you in a way um, that's, that can be pretty intense and maybe even somewhat overwhelming. Somebody opens the door and they're like, whoa. Okay, I'm Steve Coy. I'm Dorota Coy, and we're part of Hygienic Dress League. Well, first of all, to start, we're, we're conceptual artists, we're visual artists, and um, since 2007, we've been working on this project called Hygienic Dress League, and it's um, a legally registered American corporation. That's our logo, the pigeons. Yeah. <laughs> That's our branding. We had, you know, every corporation has to have a has to have like a logo and identity. I think there's a direct link to questioning why certain artists are valuable, why certain artists aren't, and, and what makes that work valuable. Also in the broader sense of like questioning value within society. And so we're using that as a, as a conceptual form of art. And it kind of explores the, the boundaries between business, art, law, commerce. Um, it gives us a chance to critique humanity. Our artwork is fun and playful, but I think Un under underlying some very serious issues. The arching overview is like our relationship with the with the planet and what effect does all of this have on it. Who we are, why we do things from like r rituals to religion to the tension between like man and nature. The human impact on the planet overall. Yeah. That's yeah. probably the underlying most visible issue that or we Or the human impact on their selves. Detroit, since its founding, has been like kind of a magnet for people to, yeah. to come and create beautiful things. We always try to create an experience that every individual when they step to look at our artwork can have their own reaction. Detroit is not just influential on us. I think it actually has been shaping our work. I mean, it's culturally, I think, very rich. <laughs> Detroit is very rich culturally. It's an inspirational Insp place. Yes.